Without further ado, let us begin The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Help me, please help me. I am a prisoner in the dungeon of the castle. My name is Zelda. The wizard, Agahin, has done something to, my, to the other missing girls. Now only I remain. Agahim has seized control of the castle and is now trying to open the seven wise men's seal. I am in the dungeon of the castle. Please help me. Knock, I'm going out for a while. I'll be back in the morning. Don't leave the house. Alright, clearly. I'll leave the house. So, um, I have seen a little bit of this, and I am limited to what I've seen in this. Because um, my son is actually playing this as well at the same time. So I've kind of seen a little bit. He hasn't got very far on it. Um, but I've kind of seen little bits and pieces that he's done. Um, but yeah, this is going to be pretty much... Um, other than kind of a bit of the castle, this is going to be a, a total blind playthrough. So... Um, yeah, I appreciate kind of like no spoilers. Hey, hey, you're not allowed in the castle. Go home and get some sleep. Now, I do know there is a secret path down here. This is one of the bits of information that I do know. Right around here. Oh, knock. I didn't want you involved in this. Just let me uh, turn down a fraction. If the game's too loud. Looks a bit loud, maybe yes. I didn't want you involved in this. I told you not to leave the house. Take my sword and shield. You can focus its power in the blade. Hold the B button. Then release it using the secret technique handed down by our people. Knock, you can do it. Save the princess. Zelda is your So my what? My sister? We'll never know. Alright, so I'm gonna get to the basement, right? <laughs> Rupees. Magic power. Excellent. Alright, so we're going to get to the basement. We are now inside the castle. I can still do it. Four calories and I close my ring. I wonder if I can burn four calories while streaming. Uh, okay, so. Um, oh no. Press the sword button, knock. Would help. By the way, I like hit that dude and he didn't even bother coming towards me. Game mechanics. It's a dungeon, so it's a basement, so this would seem right to go down, I guess. Oh, man. I've not played uh, Top Down Zelda for a while. We got the map. Excellent. What I really want to know is some health. Give me some health. You can. Thank you very much. Stop the beeping. Don't want to die. 
We got the boomerang. Give it a try. Press select to select an item. Press the start button. So we've got another dungeon to go down as well. And quite nicely, the boomerang stuns enemies, so... Quite nice. So this is where we get Zelda. I do know this. Big key. Thank you, Nelk. I had a feeling you were getting close. Nock, listen carefully. The wizard is magically controlling all soldiers in the castle. I fear the worst for my father. The wizard is an inhuman friend. Inhuman fiend, sorry, with strong magical powers. Do you understand? Of course. All right, let's get out of here before the wizard notices. I know a secret path, but first we have to go to the first floor. Let's go. Alright, we've got some rupees to start as an army. So, I think we need to go to the throne room if I remember from when my son was doing this bit. floor. Really? Oh, my sword control is terrible. I can't remember. Can you use the boomerang to pick up items? I don't want to say I can't remember. I wouldn't know because I've never played this game before, but... Yes, you can. Question answered. The secret passion in the throne room leads to the sanctuary. I'm sure the old man there will help us. The much shelf should open. Do you have a light? It's pitch black inside. You can't see it without one. If you're ready, let's go. Help me push from the left. So, let's put on our lamp. Ooh. So, luckily there is these little light things that you can light up to show where we're going. Oh my god, snakes. Snakes in the basement. Luckily, we plenty of hearts. Uh, I don't have any magic power left if I can like that. Jeez. Keep please. Thank you. Lights don't last very long as well. 
Plus, for the sewers, we'll be very close to the sanctuary. Let's be careful. That uh, right in the middle there is kind of like stuck on that platform. All right, so we've got those um, those cracks on the wall there. Uh, maybe we come back here at a later time. I'm gonna die if I'm careful, um, because they're bomb locations. So throughout, like caves and things, there are various. Um, Areas where you can bomb various bits and pieces, so I'm on half a heart here. It's not good. Oop. Hey, I done did it in my goal. I told you I'd achieve it from set here. Sentry just be on that pull. Pull the switch over there. Uh, okay. Probably uh, press A to let me try that. Alright. Alrighty then. We made it to Sanctuary. Brizola, you're safe. Is this your doing, Nock? Yes, it was Nock who helped me escape from the, from the dungeon when I was captured by the wizard. Said. The wizard said, once I have finished with you, the final one, the seal the, of the wise men will open. Nock, you must not let the land of Hyrule fall into a wizard's clutches. If he releases the seal of the seven wise men, evil power will overwhelm this land. Before that happens, before it's too late, destroy the wizard. Before he destroys all of Hyrule, you can do it. You can. I sense that a mighty evil force guides the wizard's actions and augments his magical power. The only, the only weapon potent enough to defeat the wizard is a legendary master sword. It is said that the village elder is a descendant of one of the seven wise men. Maybe he can tell you more. I'll oh, mark his house on your map. But watch, uh, watch your every move. I'm certain that the castle soldiers will be looking for you now. I will hide Prince Elder here. Do not worry. Seek the elder. Do you understand? Of course. Find the Master Sword, save the Hyrule. Same as every other Zelda. Alright. So, we are going in that direction. Excellent. Probably, that's wrong one. Probably now go back to the boomerang. Probably gonna be more helpful for us at the minute. Kakariko Village. Looks like where we're going to be going. Kakariko Village. Alright, so... It's this house here. Who? Oh, it's not you, Knock. What can I do for you, young man? The Elder? Oh, no one has seen him since the wizard began collecting victims. What? Master Sword? Well, I don't remember the details exactly, but long ago, a prosperous people known as the Hylia inhabited this land. Legends tell of many treasures that the Hylia hid throughout the land. The Master Sword, a mighty blade forged against those evil hearts, is one of them. People say that now it is sleeping deep in the forest. Do you understand the legend? Yes. Anyway, look for the Elder. There must be someone in the village who knows where he is. You take care now, Nock. All right. So, we have to find somebody in the village who will tell us where the elder is.
Yo, Nock, this house used to be a hideout for a gang of thieves. What was their leader's name? Oh, yeah. His name was Blind, and he hated Bright Light a lot. Okay. What's down here, then? Free stuff. Of course, you can only push these blocks once. So... You've uh, got to reset the room, I guess. Let's say we're going to do something like this and this. Okay. Gets us that one. And I've already moved them enough, so I can probably do the reverse of that now to get the other one. So that's another way to know if there's a crack in the wall that I talked about earlier on. Because the uh, when you hit your sword against them, it makes a different sound. Right. Let's try and find... You go through life without one of my hold anything bottles. Well, step right up and make your life complete. I've got one cell, the low price of 100 rupees. I uh, don't need it. So, okay, too bad. Come back if you earn a million rupees. Still might be here. So. Hey, here's Nock, the wanted man. Soldiers, anyone, come quickly. Oh, wow, you really? You've just. Wow. Screw you, woman. I know not to go near her again. I'll knock the room so you can have the princess, but I still trust you. Okay, he's just gonna run off. Hi, knock. Elder, are you talking about my grandpa? Okay, but don't tell anyone of the bad people about this. He's hiding in the palace past the castle. I will mark the spot on your map. Here you are. Alright, so. We've got to go over there. So, it looks like there's possibly two ways to go. Um, yeah, if we go kind of south and then east over a bridge. All right. Let's do that. Chicken kid. That's what I'm going to call you. Ooh, we have bombs. I just remember on the Game Boy, there was a way that you could confuse the guy. There was a, there's a thing that you can confuse the guy. You could run around him, get him in circles, and you can actually run out of the shop in the village with an item without paying for it. Um, but then the next time you went in the shop, he literally obliterated you. He killed you. Right, so now I've got bombs. What I will do is... Let's go back to that hideout. And see what was hiding behind that wall that we could bomb. That's what we're going to do. Piece of heart. It's not heart containers in this game. We could go back to the sanctuary as well. Yeah, we'll do that. Let's go back to the sanctuary. We'll go so we'll go north. Back the way we came. Um we'll see if we can get back into those areas. We did before. 
and see if we can use the bombs. Let's go back through the castle then. All right, let's not worry about it for now. There's something under one of these, surely. I think in Ocarina of Time you can capture the spirits and sell them. Dead? Rip me. Uh, start from the sound tree. Well, wanted not to uh, get bogged down with them for too long. They're bad news. So the uh, boomerang is great, the fact that it stuns the enemies. Magic shop, waterfall of wishing. Where am I going? I'm going to go in here then, I guess. Get through here. Oh, what's that? What's that? Oh, I think there's a chance for. Oh, he's an electric dude, isn't he? I'm sure he's an electric dude. I th I'm sure there's a way. I think, if I remember rightly, there's a chance that enemies can hide in the bushes. Double, double, draw and trouble, fire, burn, cauldron, bubble, making mushroom, brew, I am. Oh, she's going to want a mushroom, I guess. Welcome to the magic shop. The waterfall of wishing is just ahead. Oh, well, this is the wrong way. So, I guess we're going to have to go down instead. Which is fine. So I should have taken, probably taken the lower path anyway. 
None of these enemies have like health that I can. A heart would be nice, guys, please. No, just gonna keep giving me rupees. Indeed, Sahasharala. Sahasharala? The village elder and a descendant of the seven wise men. Oh, really? Knock. I'm surprised. A young man like yourself is searching for the sword of evil's bane. Not just anyone can use that weapon. Legends say only the hero who has won the three pendants can wield the sword. Do you recall? Do you really want to find it? Yeah. As a test, you can you retrieve the pendant of courage from the East Palace? If you bring it here, I will tell you more about the legend and give you a magical artifact. Now go forward to the palace. Alright, so. I've got to do something. And bring it to this guy. Not before. Let's see, and what's behind door number one? Bombs. Rupees and rupees. Excellent. Alright, so. He said the East Palace, right? Must be that one there then. Yeah. Alright. If I remember, uh, I think I'm probably going the wrong way. Uh, I can probably get there, there actually. Let's just give it a go. Uh, I think I remember those things. You have to bomb them. Bombing them is the only way to get rid of them. If they're similar to what I remember in um, Link's Awakening. Can't go that way, so gotta go around. Didn't they have some of them in like that? that those things in? I'm sure they had something similar to that in Ocarina of Time, actually. Thinking about it now. So, that's okay. So let's put out a bomb. through there. Let's go around the top. So how do I get up to that area there? Let's go down and around. Right, we made it into the palace. Okay. All right, kind of that way. Door resets every time. I'm guessing it's pretty symmetrical. And that, that's gonna yeah be like that as well. Okay.
Good start. Almost dead. Fantastic. Big dude is gonna come out at me at some point. Compass. You can now pinpoint the lair of the dungeon's evil master. It's on the second floor. Knock his eye. Sahashrala. <laughs> I can talk to you te telepathically when you touch these tiles. Here's a hint. You can use the treasure hidden in this palace to defeat armored foes. So I can't come that way. It's sort of like a one way thing. Key, you might be able to open it. I just thought those things were something. Oh, they are. Okay, so, okay, I can't defeat them. I think that's probably what he was telling me before. So, whatever is uh, the dungeon treasure, I guess it's going to help me to. I know it. I remember those things from Link's Awakening. I'm moving. Oh, we're back here. But this time we're on this walkway. Okay. Yes. 
No, I'm all out of bombs. Oh, did I need to get him to come over here, perhaps? Ha. Huh. Kind of unfortunate if I did. I need some bombs. Can I get some bombs from anywhere? I got bombs before was in the uh, when I met the old dude in the back. Please. Oh, I haven't been up here though yet. At least the bonies don't like attack me. Do you know what? I'm starting to think I don't need to bomb that guy. All I need to do is lure him onto that space, which I can do without bombs. Mm. 
Yeah, that would kind of make more sense, I feel. Alright, so, let's head back. At least we cleared all the uh, majority of the enemies. sense. I don't know why I didn't think about that, the fact that I could move him without the bomb. i will try and kill him. I don't think we'll probably, I'd, I just have a funny feeling we probably can't kill him just yet anyway. Without um, getting the special item from the dungeon that uh, it referred to. Alright, so the only other thing I can think is to do.
the only thing I can think is that I need to somehow... I need to somehow hit that pot that those enemies are going around. But I don't know how I'd do that. Bonies. So he's giving me a bomb, but I. that simple. Alright, we got the master key. Alright. Boy, do I feel dumb. So, will this now open the big chest? Take a wrong turn somewhere. Uh, maybe. I guess I did. through this room. What a dumbass. Hey, we got the bow. You can shoot arrows until you run out. Hey, man. Not cool. Not cool. Really? Death by a dead guy. the majority of it now. It's 
farm. say about saving my bows, my arrows do. <laughs> I really should probably save them though because I'm guessing we're going to want them for the, normally in Zelda, the dungeon item is crucial for the final kind of like boss fight of the dungeon, so I really should save them. Four, definitely. Bonus treasure room. Oh my goodness. Was it worth it? I don't really know. through that room without taking damage, but I'll take it. Really skeletons first because he's a red guy and I have a feeling he's probably gonna have some different attacks to what we've seen so far. Fine. 
Well, it was like not back damage. That would be pretty close now to the dungeon. Oh my goodness. Tackling now, and I have no. All right, I can hit him still with the sword. That's all right. a bit worried there that we'd run out of arrows but that would be really harsh if the game didn't let you um finish the boss off because you'd run out of arrows or bombs or whatever uh you won the pendant of courage take it to shaharala two pendants remain Alrighty then way to him. Oh, you got the Pendant of Courage. Now I will tell you more of the legend. Three or four generations ago, an order of knights protected the royalty of Hylia. These knights of Hyrule were also guardians of the Pendant of Courage. Unfortunately, most of them were destroyed in the great war against evil that took place when the seven wise men created their seal. Among the descendants of the knights of Hyrule, a hero must appear. I see. Nock, I believe you. You should get the remaining pendants and carry this with you. This is a treasure passed down by the families of the wise men. I want you to have it. It's the Pegasus Shoes. Now you can execute a devastating dash attack. Hold the A button for a short time. A helpful item is hidden in the cave on the east side of Lake Hylia. Get it. East side of the lake. Okay. Can you mark that on the map by any chance? I don't know. So. So I guess the lake is this right at the bottom, right? So it's at the east side of the lake. I'm going to have to go all the way around. I kind of want to go back to Kakariko Village as well. Because I have an inkling now that... I might be able to catch that guy that was running before. Uh, no. Let's go this way. Also, let's put something useful in there. Soothe your wounds, close your wrists, close your eyes, and relax. Thank you, great fairy. Alright, so, around here. 
I've got to go all the way around the lake, I think, to... get whatever he was talking about. this place. I'll take some more bombs, thank you very much. Right, so maybe I can't get round the lake at the minute. Oh, I'll have to go all the way around there. Okay. Oh yeah, those dudes electrocute you. They were in uh, Link's Awakening as well. Oh, what's that thing? I don't know, I'm sticking around to find out. Oh man, I wasn't even paying attention to my lives. Uh, okay, well. <sighs> Let's do that again then, I guess. I know, right? What's going on, Tess? <laughs> it wasn't giving me no chance there, was it? Jeez. How you doing, buddy? Hope you are. Oh man. Hope you're all well. I'm getting a bit lost. I don't want to be around here. I've gone too far. Did I go too far? Where am I even. What is the meaning of life? Uh, no, I didn't go too far. I didn't go far enough. I'll stay out of the wall, Link, please. It's all good, thanks, yeah. Uh, it's been on my kind of playlist for a very, very long time. And um, I was kind of saying at the start of the stream, my um, my son's kind of into Zelda and he's like started playing this. So I was kind of like, I, I suppose I better, shit. I suppose I better start playing it so that um, once he gets stuck, um, I can kind of lend a hand. So. But yeah, no. It's got, I feel it's got a lot of similarities to the gameplay style to the first Zelda I played, which was Link's Awakening. So, um, you know, I've enjoyed it so far. Had a bit of a moment in the uh, previous dungeon, though. It's like, well, how do I do this? How do I do this? And it was like so simple. It's like I had a proper derp derp. All right, let's try not to. take things a little bit more cautiously rather than just running in everywhere and oh, he says and then that happens
That's the way we bypass him. I'd honestly compare it more to the original than Zelda 2, but I get where you're coming from. Yeah, I, again, I, I've briefly played... Um, like, very briefly played the original. Um, but, yeah, I like the, my first one was Link's Awakening on the Game Boy, so... I don't know whether Link's Awakening was before or after this game. But I say, I could, I could definitely see a lot of similarities with this and that game. this I'm finding at the minute is like hardly any of the enemies seem to drop health. They all drop rupees, man. Rupees do not help. No, 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 no. I'll talk about Link's Awakening for the Game Boy. What the hell are these things? I don't know what those things are. Maybe I don't even want to know. by the plant. Hmm. I'm quite excited for the, the remake that's coming to Switch this year. So we've got a bomb, ready bomb, bomb, ready bomb, bomb, bomb. Here. So, yeah, I kind of wish I'd have now bought that bottle at Kakariko Village to, I'd assume, I assume, you can take these fairies. Um, just want to double check something. Nope, you can't. All right. This is obviously what the old man was talking about, though. Ah, there we go. Sneaky. Did I put two bombs there? I think I did. Wow. You found the ice rod. Its chill magic blasts the air, but watch your magic meter. Okay. Should we test it out? So what if this guy stood still for more than... Wow, just totally wrecked my magic bar. <laughs> to go magic bar Do you know what? I'd rather die now actually and just go back to sanctuary that's my excuse I'm sticking to it all right so no go away bombs you're too dangerous so, I'm going to go to Kakariko Village now, because I, I really want to get that um, bottle. I think it's going to be very helpful for me now. 
I also want to see now I've got the Pegasus boots. Sorry, the Pegasus shoes in this. Um, whether I can catch that other guy. Now she's going to kick off if I go too close to her, isn't she? Where was he? There he is. Dundee good. Hmm. Alright. Interesting. Did you meet up with Grandpa? If all the bad people go away, he can come back to the village. Yes, he can. Thank you. I guard an empty bottle. A winner is me. Alright, so... I don't think... I don't think there's a right and wrong order to getting the next pendants, so... Let's go down to this bottom corner. Silly things like that. Oh my god, and then it comes back to life, of course. Been gooned. shop. Oh, that'll work. Fire fountain's always good. Thank you all. Pay no attention to the average middle-aged man standing by the sign. Leave him alone. What the hell are these things? Oh my god. Mommy! I wanna go home. Um Really? I'm 
short on magic power. Can I give you a bomb, maybe? Or two. Just to keep pressing the wrong button. Uh, okay. So there's a... So dead. Can I reheal at the fairy fountain? Yes. All right. So. So, where do we go now? Are links allowed? Uh, you mean in chat? I think so. Alright, so maybe we can go... Maybe we can go up to the top there. Yeah, I don't think I've got a ban on links test. Lucky. I feel like this could be the way I need to go. There was a sign though on that rock. I need to work out how to get up to there. Oh, hello, mister. I am Agina. Ag Agina? Agina. I sense something is happening in the Golden Land. And seven wise men, the seven wise men sealed. This must be an omen of the great cataclysm foretold by the people of Hylian blood. The prophecy says the hero will stand in the desert holding the Book of M Medora. If you have the Book of Medora, you can read the language of the Hylian people. It should be in the house of the books in the village. You must get, you must get it if you are the person who will be the hero. Okay. What are you hiding behind there, mate? What you hiding? Hey, piece of heart. Excellent. Right, so I've got to go back now to... I'll go back to the village then. To the library. It wants me to go. If there's something there, I need to... Let's get up there by the looks of it. So that rock looks a bit out of place, so I'm not on my own, am I? That rock definitely looks out of place. Um, which way did they come from? Oh, please. This totally looks like a place I should be able to go and do stuff. Uh, is the library marked on my map? No. It is not. Hey, it's my house. Papa not home though. Mm 
and soldiers are so dumb. They're like, hey, I can see you. I'm looking right at you, but I'm not going to attack you because... stuff. So I'm going the right way. Yeah. It's all right. Right, so we need to find the library. I don't play no mini games. I guess the library is the place with the massive book on the roof, right? That makes sense. You found the Book of Medora. You can use it to read the ancient language of the Hylia. Excellent. All right, back to the desert we go. Is there actually any danger of getting some hearts? Thank you. It was a bomb! No! That's not good. I think we're dead, boys. It's not looking good. Alright. I'm safe for now. Just need to make it to the a um, little bit further, and we've got the um, fairy fountain, right? All moves, stay away from him. All right, fairy fountain. So I guess I need to huh no in which case maybe I need to go and talk to this old guy again. Say the menu keys. Oh, do you know what? I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button. I pressed, uh, yeah. I didn't press the. I pressed the uh, grab button. I didn't press the item button, as Tess has rightly said. My bad. Oh, me, boys. I'm sorry. Oh, please. Wow. Just... Oh, 
Oh my goodness. So over the way to go forward, make your wish here, and it will be granted. Alright, well, we're in the dungeon at least, so that's the same point, right? get it over and done with, right? It was definitely coming. Just now I get some more health. Oh wow. I should probably try and bomb that guy. I know, right? I was thinking to myself earlier, it's it's like really weird. It's like, you can't take those other dudes out until you get the bow and arrow, unless you throw a pot at them. Magic pots for the win. Take me outside. I'm sure I'm going to do this. Because I'm worried where... Let's just take me back to there. It's just a way out, right? It would seem. never fail to find all the treasures in each dungeon. Really? I was hiding behind that pillar. Don't give me that. I call BS. Of course, the key. Lighting these will make a difference though. Oh, 
It's worth a try. Oh, please. Being doomed. Attack me until I'm armed with my pot. Then, then may you attack me. Okay, so now I think I've got to do this with the lanterns. No. Huh. Man. Just seriously, do one. Thank you. And no, you're not even going to give me my treasure. Seriously, this game. Switch somewhere, surely. There we go. Hey, great fairy. Okay, so. Do I not? Okay, obviously, I can't take a fairy in the bottle then, so it doesn't work how I thought it would. What? You got a couple there? That's not sand. How dare you? Rude. Oh, I got a key. Of course, I got a key. What a dumbass. Try using the key, shall we? Come burst, but we're dead. <laughs> oh dear. We got the compass, but we're dead. Good times.
Death by Compass. We saw it here first. This level there that I haven't um, entered by the looks of it. This one. Have I not been in here? Power glove, you can feel strength in both hands. You can pick up and carry stones now. All right, so now I, w I think I've got to go back outside. Yeah, because there was that um, extra bit at the top, wasn't there? So, let's go right down here. think there we go really really Don't push. Now, where I'm thinking... Let's get the hell out of Dodge. It wasn't, what, it wasn't actually what I thought I was going to be doing, but... by touching the frickin' 
inside of that thing. Oh man, I couldn't even see it. And it killed me. That's, um... Man, that's, that's so unfair. So unfair. Alright Tess, next time my man. Uh, I'll probably be heading, calling at night after this anyway, so uh, yeah, thanks for stopping by though. Appreciate it, as always. So... Wall. I guess this is boss fight time. So I don't understand where I'm, why I'm getting damaged here. Randomly taking damage, and I don't. I don't understand why I'm like randomly taking damage. All right, well, I know what we're doing this time. Alright, 
got through it pretty well that time. I just need a better run through here. I don't understand why I'm taking damage near the walls. Oh, it's the rocks. Okay. I gotcha. I understand now. Why I'm taking the damage. I think I know how to avoid the majority of it. The rocks seem to come off at like a diagonal to where they're going. So as long as I don't try, as long as I try and avoid the di the di four diagonals, um, I should be all right. Showtime. I wonder if I can freeze one of them. Strats. Change the attack though, yes, you will. You we get it, boys and girls. We did it.
The second pendant is ours. You want the pendant of power. Your goal of finding three pendants is in sight. Go for the last one. Woo! All right, well. I am going to leave it there for tonight, guys. Thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in. I appreciate it. Uh, we'll be back playing some more Zelda Link to the Past on Monday night. But until then, I've been knocking you. You've been awesome. See ya.